This is the spirit uh, detector tracker. I'll just show you some of the things. The first thing is the batteries. What it just slides off. You put the batteries in. It takes uh, four. You can either use rechargeable or or normal 1.5 volt batteries. I suggest probably using 1.5 batteries would be better than rechargeable but if you want to use rechargeable which I normally do you can and then there's a switch on the battery pack the lights come on that indicates what what strength the lights are at and then there's different modes by the, some things I've added, I had trouble putting the uh, circuit board up to the top of the box so I've had to use four bolts which work perfect. And just uh, that's, that's, I keep it on the third, um, the third mode which seems to be the one what people use the most. This, um, it goes through different modes. This is the first mode. You just click it once to change through modes. Once the light goes off, it's changed into different modes. And there's that, that one. That's the one I use most of the time. I think maybe this might be a mode what people might use a lot. It's the lights stay on, and as the shadow goes past, the lights dim. That's quite a good mode. And the last one, the lights stay on, and then they, they dim slowly. Also, if you keep it pressed down for two seconds, once the lights come on, you can change the sensitivity. And it's recommended that the sensitivity is on number three. And then it'll just click off. And you can put it back to which mode you want it on again. I like that mode, but it seems a little bit quick. I don't know if I like three or not. number seven the best one. I think number seven's quite good. It's got infrared lights, so if I just turn the lights off, I can get the room in, it's a mess. I've got the flash on that. Turn the flash off. 